Welcome back everyone. I was going to try to fit this whole entire thing in this specific video, but it's totally okay. I'm going to go ahead and show you exactly how to screenshot on any iPad, especially the iPad 8th generation. So this is more specifically the home button iPads and or the only iPads that are the iPad 8th generation. Now to screenshot, it's actually pretty easy. So first of all, you want to locate the power button, which is usually on the top right corner, but if it's in the other way, it'll be on the top left or bottom right or whatever. And you want to locate the home button. As you can see, it's right here. So what you want to do is you want to hold down the home button while you're pressing down this power button at the same time. So just like this, three, two, one, you want to hold it down until you get a little, you know, clicking sound like that. And you will see that you have the screenshot right there. Now, once you have the screenshot right there, you can tap on it. So I'll go ahead and do it again. So hold it down, get into that panel. Now you can go ahead and click on it just like here. And you can see that you can modify the screenshot however you want to. So if you want to go and, you know, highlight some things or whatever, you can go and select the colors. You can select which specific pencil, marker, whatever you want. You can go ahead and draw on it. Now, a really cool thing within it is if you want to go ahead and modify it even more, you can go and click on these specific things and change the basically the hardness of that color as well as just the size of that color as well. So now if you can see, it's a lot bigger, it's a lot more noticeable. So if I want to, I can go and, you know, draw circles and stuff. Now, a really cool thing with iPad OS 14, which the iPad 8th generation supports, is we can now draw perfect shapes within our Photos app. So if I go ahead and take a circle here and I hold it down, you can see that it'll automatically go ahead and draw a circle for me. That's perfect. And the same thing with an arrow. If I go ahead and draw, well, this one's not going to be good. You kind of have to do it in like one suit. So like, just like that. And I messed it up again. So just like this. There we go. So now it draws a perfect arrow too. So as you can kind of compare, this one is far better than those ones. You have to remember to kind of do them at the same time. Now, if you want to share this off or you want to save it, what you can do is if you want to save it, you want to go ahead and click done. But if you want to send, but if you want to send it off to somebody, you can go ahead and click share up here. So just go ahead and click the share button right there. And you can go ahead and airdrop it to somebody. You can go ahead and text it to somebody. You can go and mail it to somebody. I think you can even open it in Snapchat and stuff. So there's a lot of capability behind this specific app too. So that's exactly how you go ahead and screenshot on any iPad 8 generation. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really discount. So it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my main channel. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.